it's Kirby and Dana from KJF Travel Adventures and we're heading to New Hampshire for Thanksgiving to visit some family and all we do on vacation is eat so we're going to take you along on a little mini food tour in the Manchester, New Hampshire area. Let's go! Willie Jewel's barbecue. Mm. That was really good. It was really good. So we got the we shared a three, three meat, meat combo, combo with two sides, and then we ordered us another side. And then the table we were with my family. The table got cornbread and corn fritters, and corn fritters which were both delicious. That was the vegetable. That, yes, the corn fritters were. I had a vegetable with lunch. So, <laughs> um, so we had ribs, turkey, and burnt ends. Yep. And then they had four different like sauces. It was it was so. Good. I could eat another order of those corn fritters and all another order of burn ends. Uh, I thought the hush puppies were the best. Oh, and we, yes, one of our songs was hush puppies and onion rings, and even those were good. Like, it, yeah, everything was really good. It was really good. Very casual dining. Yeah, they were super friendly. Mm -hmm. So, it was. Stop to in our food tour of New Hampshire. We're in Amherst at the Village Green at Moulton's Market. So Moulton's Market and Kitchen, mm -hmm. something to that effect, um, is literally like a big market, and then they have you know hot, so it's small, market. small, big for New Hampshire. It has a little bit yes. of groceries. Yeah, it has a little bit of um, like snacky things. It seemed to be because we were there lunchtime on a weekday because we're visiting family. It seemed to be the like grab and go. I'm gonna come get nice hot lunch on my lunch break from work. It was a lot of professional and and workers like coming in working and taking their lunch to go so that seems to be sort of like the local lunch spot mm -hmm. um, but it was cute um, I had a roast beef sandwich with Warsan cheese it was really good I had a pastrami sandwich. and then I had uh, pumpkin donut muffins they were yeah I don't know why they were donut muffins they were little donut holes they were delicious it was good I could eat like six more things from there so okay and they had ice cream and they had a whole like thing of like baked good treats so We'll, go, we'll probably be back. Thirsty Moose. That's what our third, our third time there. Mm -hmm. Second, at least our third time there. Um, 
in it. So it's like a little, it's a small chain in New Hampshire. They have four or five locations in the like Merrimack, Manchester, New Hampshire area. And it's like your, your kind of like typical tap room bar food. Mm-hmm. Um, we got, we shared a pretzel the size of, um, I think larger than our faces. I mm-hmm. think it was larger than our faces. Mm-hmm. Um, I do wish that came with beer cheese sauce and that might be a supply chain thing because I feel like it's come with beer cheese sauce before. Maybe. But I don't know. I always have the spicy mustard. She always has mustard, so she doesn't care. Um, and I had a grilled chicken barbecue sandwich that was really good. I had salads. She had salad. I had this giant pastrami sandwich. <laughs> she had a huge pastrami sandwich at lunch. So right. basically all we've done is eat while we're here. Hence why you're getting a food tour vlog. So We're a food, we're a food channel now. We're a food channel <laughs> Look, we, we, we coordinate. Look at yeah, that. All right. Um, I think we're done eating for today, so we'll probably be... Maybe. Maybe. All right. <laughs> Bye. from NATO subs it's a little like a small chain it's a family run chain they have a couple different locations um, and they're famous for their steak tips so I got a steak tip sub obviously because they're famous for their steak tips I got a cold turkey but they're... it was good the bread is the bread was really <laughs> yes, good the bread was really good and fresh and the sandwiches <clears throat> excuse me are are like big you got one and shared so shared with my I... mom I ordered a steak tip sub and ate the whole thing because, you know, vacation. They're bigger than a foot. Yeah. Long. So they're huge. They were huge. Yeah. And the and the the little girls got chicken nuggets and they enjoyed them. Yes. They're the best chicken nuggets. Also ketchup. Oh. <laughs> also ketchup. So uh, <laughs> But it was really good and I, I've had it before. Um but the steak tip. If you go to NATO's, get steak tips. We went to Chen Yang Li and forgot to take any photos of food because <laughs> we really, dove right in. We were hungry and it was really good. Um, we it, got um, we got cashew things. chicken, string beans, like yep. sautéed string beans, and then they had a play on your traditional sort of orange chicken. Yeah, and they had either tangerine chicken or strawberry chicken, and we ordered the tangerine chicken and it had mm-hmm. a kick. I didn't have any because it was it, it was, was a little spicy, but spicy. The, it was. It was, it was delicious. Yeah. And we got also mushu. I love mushu yeah, so it's like Dana's favorite Chinese food. It was and it's I hard had, to find. I had chicken wings. Um they were good. Every Chinese food place I have ever ordered chicken wings from does them a different way, but they were really good. Um clearly the food was really good because we dove in without taking photos, but they served us family style and I'm sure that there's an option to not do that if that's what you're but your family Yeah, does. we intended to eat family style, yeah. so, so that was perfect it for was, us. It um, was five of us. Yeah. So we ordered a couple of So we ordered quite a lot of food. Soups, and we ate oh, all yeah, of it. Oh, yeah, um, I got wonton soup, and my parents got hot and sour soup, mm-hmm. and I think it was very spicy because their noses were running. Yeah. Um, That's why I didn't t- try the tangerine chicken after they commented how spicy the it soup was. It wasn't that spicy. No? Okay. No, but it was good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, I would definitely go back fun there. Fun to see a different than your traditional it, like orange. It's located in a strip that was a lot of shopping. So if you're around that area doing your grocery trip or yeah, they were know. open for lunch and dinner. Yeah, it was oh yeah, it was nice. It was very nice. We'd go back. Okay.
next day we started with breakfast at DW Diner. There were 11 of us. <laughs> Not so, really designed for no. 11 people. They did a but great job accommodating did. us. They did. Um, and our waitress was amazing <laughs> to deal with 11 yep. people. Um, but it's, it's like classic diner food, I yes, think. Yes, traditional diner. I think everyone ordered breakfast. Everyone ordered obviously breakfast. obviously we ordered yep. breakfast at a diner. Yeah. We went I got at lunch pancakes. Mm -hmm. And I got everything. So I got the, I don't know what they called it. I don't know what their version of it, but like <laughs> it was two eggs, two protein. So I got bacon, uh, hash browns, and then two uh, pancakes. And you, you could sub French toast or you could sub some other carb. And then it also came with regular toast. So I had a little bit of everything and it was all delicious <laughs> it's really good like it's just you can't go wrong with just well-made breakfast food like hot fresh well-made breakfast you know who food. did get lunch food with the girls oh yes the yep. girls got chicken nuggets obviously <laughs> french fries and ketchup yep <laughs> <laughs> and they enjoyed them not as good as nato subs chicken nuggets though. wow yeah just them out. yeah i mean that's yeah Someone like has them. convinced the girls that the best chicken nuggets in the area is NATO subs. And I think it was my brother so that he could order NATO subs more. <laughs> Fair. Yep. <laughs>
anything else about hot rice or anything else. All right. There's so many more places. So I'm sure, well, we spend uh, a bit of time in New Hampshire, so there might be uh, round two of this uh, as we eat more things. Very so, yeah. Although we tend to go back to the same places because they're really good. Yeah. Oh well. I'm Kirby. I'm Dana. I'm KDF Travel Adventures. Make sure you subscribe to the channel so you get notified when all of our new videos drop. Bye. Bye.